Hey there guys, Desrin here and welcome to another video. So I've recently switched internet service provider from BT to Plusnet. Plusnet and BT aren't that different, they still use the same OpenReach network for all their lines and they still use the same hardware as BT. You probably noticed the Plusnet Hub 1 pretty much the same as the BT Hub 4. Um, it looks like the BT Hub 4, near enough the BT Hub 5. But anyway, I thought I'd show you a brief video on, again, how to enable the ports, well, unblock the ports, so that you can run your own Minecraft server from your PC. So first things first, you need to come to your control panel for your Plusnet Hub 1. And that's the same address as the BT Home Hub, 192.168.1.254. Once you're here, then you just need to head to Advanced Settings. You will need to enter your password here. I've already entered mine so it will allow you to continue now once you get to this point you need to go to your firewall your firewall is where all your port forwarding happens under your gamer application they might have minecraft in here now i highly doubt it let's take a look no they don't so in which case that's fine what you can do is go to manage games and applications add a new game or application you can call it minecraft uh, don't copy an existing game because it wasn't there was none in there. The protocol first is TCP, and again, if you're running a normal Minecraft server, the normal port is going to be two five five six five. So two five five six five, all the way across, and then you hit add. And again, you want to do the same for UDP. The reason you do this is it's two different type of connection. Um, and to be honest, I'm not too sure what Minecraft runs on. I'm pretty sure it's UDP, but I always add them both just to be safe. Um, yeah, these are just transfer protocols for the internet. So once you've done that, you just hit apply. And upon hitting apply, you go back to port forwarding. You select your game now, which obviously you have called Minecraft. Uh, da -da 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 -da, just there. And you select your device that you port forwarding for. In my case, it's going to be for my gaming PC. Hit add. And your home hub should now add it. Just in case, you can hit apply just to make sure that the changes are made. Now, that should now allow you, in theory, to host your Minecraft server from your PC. If it doesn't, however, you just need to enable DMZ, which is Demilitarization Zone. It essentially opens all ports. It's quite dangerous. Um... If you, for example, if you just play Minecraft for a while, then enable it for a while and then turn it back off. You can obviously you choose which device it's going to be on. Enable the DMZ. I'm not going to enable it now because it just opens every single port. Basically, anything can get through, um, but it will allow you to play Minecraft. And then, as long as you turn it off after you finish playing, no harm done, right? And if there is any harm done, as long as it's your PC, your equipment, doesn't really matter. So yeah guys, that was a quick, very quick video just showing you how to set up and port forward your own Minecraft server on the Plusnet Hub 1, otherwise known as the BT Hub 5 and 6, maybe a 4, I'm not too sure. It all looks the same to be honest, they haven't really changed much at all. If you need any more help or advice, just pop a, uh, just drop a comment below and I'll try and get back to you when I can. I'm trying to respond to everyone on this video, it's an update on my last video, we'll see where we go. Thanks for watching guys, I'll catch you in the next video.